Well, hello there, Mark. Well, hello there, Colin. Welcome to the Grape Depression, where we take turns finding the most outrageous wines to try and review. Indeed. So, what do you have for me today? Mark. Yes. Let me ask you something before I get to this whole wine business. Here. Before getting there, okay. Yeah. Are you, are you superstitious at all? You're breaking mirrors, you know, walking under a ladder? No. No. No? Okay, <laughs> that's good. I bring you a very fun wine today. I've been very excited to showcase this for the channel. I didn't even know this existed until a couple, uh, last week? A couple yeah, weeks well, ago. Yeah, most, most wines we get don't realize they existed before, but yeah. You're, you're not helping my story. Sorry, go for it. Sorry. Anyways. I went on a little trip a couple weeks ago. You did. Uh, I went to Boston. Yep. We made a side trip to Salem, Massachusetts. Okay. Now, you know Salem, right? Sure. It's yeah. like the the central for witch history. Yes. Yes. Very fun. I'm starting to enjoy what it's going now. I got a wine that's going to be very special to you as well, oh. I think. Okay. So, cat's out of the bag on this one, Mark, because I oh. got you. Oh my God. A black cat wine. That, that is really creepy. Oh my God, the closer you look at it, the creepier it gets. Have you taken a close look to this thing? Oh my God, it looks like chocolate. Yeah, it almost <laughs> kind of, looks right? like a wrapped like chocolate rabbit. Whoa, that's amazing. <laughs> Works great for so, occasions uh, like Halloween. Yeah, uh, and it, yeah, or, and yeah, it's or just cat lovers as well. Oh my god! But I'm like, this needs to be in our collection. <laughs> yeah, that definitely this needs, to be, needs to be in our oh collection. My, that's amazing. So wow, it's so creepy. Oh my god. <laughs> um, there's there's really not much to talk about. There's not. It's a it's a wrestling, uh, and. It has alcohol. <laughs> it's 10% alcohol, that's really light too. All right, well, I, oh man, I'm gonna screw in there. Oh. Mark, you always said you wanted a cat. Alive, yeah. I'm just... This is really weird. <laughs> but seriously, this is really weird and creepy. I mean, that is that is peak creepiness right there. I, th I thought it was more cute than creepy, but. I mean, it, it's cute because it's a cat, but it's a really creepy bottle. I hope the, the cork is unique. That's always the, the great thing about this channel, is the bottles are always great, but the yep. question is, how great are the corks? Because, oh, oh. Nice! It's a bunch of cats! <laughs> <laughs> All right, well. <laughs> <It's>... <laughs> now, uh, if you want to try this wine yourself, there is a link below. Um, wow, you always pour me the biggest, like, I taster wine. I kind of forgot that we were just tasting it. I was just, you're right, you know what? I'm gonna give, give myself a proper taste. <laughs> wow, someone really is thirsty. Jeez. <laughs> oh. This is really light, it's only 10% alcohol, yeah. so. All right. This is very smooth. Quite sugary, but not, not cheap overly. sugary. Yeah. Quite fruity. It's pretty good. I mean, I'm trying to decipher the, the fruits in there, but I taste some pear. I think it's like mostly pear, honestly. Yeah. It feels very peary. Mm -hmm. Peary. Yeah, peary. Yeah, it's, it's, yeah, it's, it's pretty straightforward. It's, it, it's almost too sweet. It's in the limit of being too sweet mm -hmm. for me, but. I mean, I, I honestly feel like I could I could have like one of I could have like a Colin glass and I would still you know really enjoy it. Yeah, it's so pretty good. Simple, smooth, and spooky. Spooky and creepy. Yeah, yeah. It, it goes pretty fast. <laughs> no, great find. I mean, thank you. That's surprisingly great. I mean, anytime it's pretty good here, it's always surprising. True. <laughs> so, True. Uh, I mean, yeah. I mean, I don't know how much it, it, how much it was for you, but this is a this is a good wine. It's a good like party wine. It's refreshing. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a really yeah. nice party wine. It, it tastes really good. It's very smooth. I think everybody could like this. I'm gonna give it an eight. Solid eight. Eight. Okay. Yeah, it's a, this is good. 
I am gonna go for a seven. I like it, it's very drinkable, smooth, but it, it's pretty basic. There's nothing yeah. that special besides the bottle, but the bottle is very simple. The bottle is incredible, and it comes with a little, little thingy there. I would honestly recommend this. This is this is pretty great. Well, I am sure looking forward to what you are gonna bring next time on oh. the Grape Depression. Oh, yes, I am so excited for you. It's gonna be a very special one.